That's better. Uh, sorry, Lexine. I was next to the recharging station. Are you calling about tonight? No, because then it wouldn't be a surprise. I'm mad at you, Sam Caldwell. Why? Because you somehow forgot to tell me what you're doing today. It's just a routine excavation. Routine? You're extracting a marker. My supervisor, Leon's nuts with excitement. Did you know he's a unitologist? This is a big deal. Leon's always been nuts. Anyway, we don't know if it's a marker or just a big rock. That's why we're doing this, so the boffins can study it. Sam Caldwell, if you had an imagination, you'd be dangerous. We'll see about that tonight. Ooh, I look forward to it. Gotta go, honey. I love you. I love you too. Later. Sam, come on. Get suited up quicker. The only date you'll have is with an overtime sheet. <laughs> Say no more. Lexine's already mad at me. She'd kill me if I bailed on her. Well, everyone else is standing by. All we're waiting for is you, so don't expect me to make excuses if we're still working tonight. Let's get this done. Sam, is your helmet secure? Sterling, this is Cooper. We're already out of sight. Where the hell are you guys? Yeah, we're on our way, boss. Be there in a minute. You seen that vidlog of the marker that's going around? It looks just like the one back on Earth. Just like the one the unitologists claim is back on Earth, you mean. And there's one big difference. Earth is Earth. Whereas this beautiful place we call Aegis 7 is nothing but a ball of space rock. I mean, come on, what are the odds? Hey Banks, what do you need? The wind's blown out some of the track we laid. Rivet it back into place and get it tight.
That thing's gotta be man-made. Hurry up! Cooper's already pissed off that we're late. Copy that. I'm right behind you, Sterling. Target practice paid off, huh? Good job. Now get the loader's arms in position. One of you TK it, the other two rivet the joints. Egan, I'll take these two. And watch your aim. I don't want to end up on crutches like Matthews. Right in the hole. Nice job. by the marker. Caldwell, you finish the job. On it, boss. All right, Egan, let's get this thing on board. Lex seems right. Leon would flip if he saw this. Steady your hand there, Sam. I got it. Almost there. is stable, gyros online. Ready for load. Stand by. I'm starting a five down. Five, four, three, two, one, mark. We gotta get a move on. Sterling to Central. I'm outside. Can you tell me what that bang was? Shit. The flash must have knocked out comms, too. Can't see a thing without the lights. There should be a box of glowworms in the airlock storage chamber. We can use them. You were right. I found a glowworm. Look around. We should grab some supplies before we head down. Shit, 
Sounds like someone's in trouble. Hold on! Wait a second, we don't know what's going on in there. What the fuck? What in God's name are you doing? Get off him! Stop! I'll shoot you! You know these rivet guns pack a punch. Shit! Help me! He's out of his mind! Sterling! Leave this. Sam, get that rock saw. We may need it. Jesus Christ, we just killed someone. We don't have time to think about that. If we don't fix that tether fast, we'll all be dead. Move! Look out! More of them! They've all gone fucking crazy! <laughs> Let's go. Tether 16's a few levels down. Up ahead. You guys see that? It's blocked. Looks like they had problems down here before. This is a bad idea. We shouldn't have come this way. Sam, calm down. Cut that security line. Use that rock saw you picked up. Coming through. Lexine? They must have put this here to stop people coming up. Can't believe we're doing this. Boss, some strange shit's going down here. I don't want excuses, Sterling. I want that gravity tether fixed. There it is, over there. It's coming, man. Oh God, it's calling oh, us. Quiet. You hear that? They're coming. There's no way to hide. God help us all. Someone's trapped in there. Is there anybody I'll left? I'll check it out and meet you in the gravity tether room. Go. It's death, Sam. Can't you see it? It needs our help. Egan, what the hell are you talking about? Get a grip! But Zachenko... We killed him! I know. But you saw what happened in there. It's... It's like it wasn't really him. We should take that plasma cutter too. Listen to us. This is all wrong. Why? 
Come on, Egan. I don't want to waste any more time down here. Let's just do this and get out of here. Look out! There's more! Shit! Get behind me! Ah! Oh! Ah! You don't understand. It's not right! We have to end it! Shit! Egan, stop! What are you doing? You can't stop it. You can't fight it. Don't... Don't make me shoot you. Egan, please! Oh, God, Egan. I'm sorry. This is Cooper. I can't reach Sterling or Egan. How are you guys doing? Something bad's happened. Egan, he went crazy and everyone down here, they're trying to kill us. Egan's gone. You're breaking up. I can barely hear you. Just get on that tether before it starts a feedback loop and takes everything down with it. What's going on? Are you okay? Come on! Don't make me do this! I'm trying to save you! Jesus! Hold it together! Central to Caldwell. Stasis modules are standard equipment for all Megavent personnel. I know you haven't been trained in it, but if you find one, it could come in handy. There! Perfect. Okay. Just need to stasis it at the right moment.
Are you okay? Lexine, God, it's good to hear you. Things are pretty bad right now. No. I mean, did you hear? Some unitologists just killed themselves in Union Square. There are pictures. It's horrible. Leon was there. People are flipping out all over the colony. We've been attacked and Egan went crazy. I killed him, Lex. You... Sam? Say that again. I killed Egan. I had no choice. He tried to kill me. I'm scared. Somebody just told me some sectors are losing oxygen, too. Hold on. That could be from the blast. The life support power room isn't far from here. You think that's what's wrong with the oxygen? Just hold tight, baby. I'll fix it. I promise. Oh, no! Stay away from me! Life support is through here. Now entering zero gravity. Warning, colony life support systems offline. Hey, Nichols, unless you want CEC to slap you with another there fine, I suggest Hope you get the these mega fans fixed. They damn near knocked Lee off his workstation today, and all the debris they're kicking up isn't helping either. to focus. Why'd you kill me? I'm not a monster. Sam! Sam, what's the matter? <sighs> Nothing. It's all right. Just stay out of sight, okay? Be careful. I love you. I love you. <clears throat> what the hell? God, I thought you were... I've got to get out of here. Back to Lexine. We have to stop it. Is this even real? Real. 
We're not going to die! Shooting one of your own is never good. He's not even packing a gun. You're shitting me. This is the guy that slaughtered his entire crew. Why'd you do it, son? All these people never did anything to her. Lex. He's gone. Call Commander James and get Doc Schiarella down here. He's gonna have a busy day. Sam. I love you. Detective Nathan McNeil. Well, I'll be damned. Gabe Weller. When I requested help from the Ishimura, I didn't realize they had you on board. Transferred six months ago. It's been a long time, Nate. It's good to see you. No, it's been hell down here. Some extra hands will come in useful. Sorry, no cop duty. We have an errand. An errand? Gabe, we've got assaults, murder, suicides, almost 60 dead and dozens injured. Nobody here's ever seen anything like it. I just can't cope. Cope? Wasn't it you who pulled me out of a three-way firefight on Scorpio 6 and then went back in to plant limpets? And now some crazy miners have got you losing sleep? It's not that simple. So what is this errand anyway? Baines! Hutchins! Hey. You too, rookie. We need to get to the morgue. Think you can cope with giving us direction? I'll take you. I have to drop this off at evidence anyhow. What do you want with the morgue? The captain sent us to retrieve the bodies from the Union Square suicide before they pop the cork on the planet. But keep it quiet, okay? Oh, sure. Your crew is really inconspicuous. You gonna introduce us? Baines and Hutchins, two of my best. Detective. A pleasure. And Carklin's here as my rookie. It's an honor, sir. Sergeant Weller speaks highly of you. <laughs> Jeez. Don't let him fill your head with his macho tales, son. Baines, Hutchins, go prep the shuttle and wait for us. Yes, sir. All right, follow me. 